Hmm. All right. This is a groove pad. Uh, basically, you make tunes and other stuff like this. I've been playing around for it for quite a long time. A couple, uh, no, not a couple of years. Uh, a couple of months, maybe. Um, and I've been using it to try and create the feeling of Half-Life 3's chapter. Or not Half-Life 3's chapter. Half-Life 3, the music of Half-Life 3. And it's pretty amateur. Like, very amateur. But, hey, I'm, I'm trying my best. I'm doing what I love. Because I love this thing. This thing's great. So, uh, we're going to create a couple songs. Okay, I like that. Okay. Alright. I'm a huge fan of metal and electric guitars. So this is really cool. I really like this one. Industrial rock. Ooh. Ooh, that's a good bass. That would make really good for background. That'd be, that, that's really good. Okay. So we'll have that. Okay. Eh. That has some good synths in it. Oh, that's good. That's good. Let's hear the other ones. That's even better. Meh. All right, these two are my favorites here. All right. Ooh, that gives it a nice grungy feel to it. I like that. We're going to use drums. All right. Alright, that, that sounds like good. That sounds good. Alright, here we go. Um, I didn't mean to do that. <laughs> oh, great, it's over. Great. <laughs> fuck. Uh, fuck. Okay. I was trying to hit the synth. What the? Ah, I dropped my phone. What is this? Get out of here. This isn't an ad. This, this isn't sponsored. Ah! Ah, it scared me. <laughs> Yeah, all right, so here's all the songs I made with, uh, we can listen to them. I won't show you all of them. 
I'll I'll let you f- like give you the first ten seconds of the. So it isn't one specific genre. There's a lot of genres that I used, but I tried to make them as sci-fi, bassy, grungy, and like that kind of stuff. I like the way it travels across your ears like that. If you're wearing headphones. ZPEFM, of course, stands for Zero Point Energy Field Manipulator, a.k.a. the Gravity Gun. Oh, it gives me an erection, that start there. Oh, it's so good. Ooh. I tried to give the elite soldiers a sinister tone in their song. Um, but also sort of an upbeat, energetic sort of run and gun style. There's endless dimensions. Oh, and don't mind these ones. These ones aren't related at all. Hell yeah. Hell yeah. Alright, so basically, um, yeah, I have made a lot of these. I try to make this one mysterious. It doesn't have the same punch as Nuclear Emission Jam, but it's it's sort of um I could substitute it in for um something like getting an upgraded version of the HEV suit. Something like that. I tried to make the military, because in my version of Half-Life 3, you meet up with surviving members of the military that aren't, that weren't destroyed when the Combine invaded, as well as meeting up with Adrian Shepard again. All of the military-related sort of, um, uh, tracks have a, at least one kind of metal electric guitar in it. Hear it in the background there. Oh yeah, um, <laughs> Mr. Friendly. Hell yeah. 
Hell yeah, a zen nest. I've got a lot of really good ideas for what Half-Life 3 could be like. This would be the song that plays when you go into something called City 14. It's like City 17, but, you know, a different number and a different place. This would play while you're in there fighting the Combine alongside Dog. Oh, yes. I want to have multiple endings in there, and one of them, it's an ending where Gordon dies. Yeah, I see uh, City 14. It's the perfect sort of track for running for your life and fighting back at the same time. I have no clue why I named it the Judas Paradox, but whatever. Oh, yes. Eventually, in my version of the story, Gordon and Alex venture into the remains of the nuked Black Mesa facility to retrieve something that wasn't totally destroyed in the explosion that can help the resistance. You got uh, songs that would play there would be a black the black mesa combat theme memories of a resonance cascade and um possible neurotics This is when you enter the chamber of the not totally destroyed uh, anti mass spectrometer. I asked point desertion. Desertion. You got point insertion, point extraction, and now you got point desertion. Des desertion. Whatever. Then you got Adrian's last stand. And then you just got a bunch of uh, random shit here. Lel. <laughs> so yeah, um, yeah, there are millions of songs in this thing. You got genres all over the place. It is really good. If you're into music like I am. You're going to love this app. <laughs> 